All right. My name is Brett Mothershead, Statesville, North Carolina. Uh, I guess one of the reasons I think I deserve, well, I probably don't deserve a new Beretta, but one of the reasons I think I do is because I've only bought one out of the five I own. I've only bought one brand new, and that was this, Model 96, in 1996. That's a little apropos, but that's the first and only Beretta I ever bought brand new. The rest, because I'm a dumbass carpenter, I had to get on consignment. It's a 92 I bought from a friend who didn't like guns anymore, and I sold it to a friend, and then I, I freaked out a little bit and bought it back because I might have a problem. Anyway, those are lever guns. You don't care about those. And here we have the two uh, powder puff guns. I got this from a buddy at the gun club who inherited it from his father. It's a 28 gauge 686 Onyx. He said it was a pain in the ass to shoot because he couldn't hit anything. And I said if it was a pain in the ass to shoot, he wasn't using it right. But anyway, this is a hunting tool right here. This is another one I bought from a consignment shop, used, of course. Oops. It's a uh, 20 gauge because I'm a little seller. I like the, little su I like the sub gauges. I, I like to carry the little sub gauges. They don't beat you on the skeet field or the trap field or the sporting clays field. And they're just a joy to carry because, you know, at the end of the day, you take out the same five shells you put in at the beginning of the day. That's up on bird hunting, according to JB's dad. But here's the big stick. This I bought used in another consignment shop, but this gun has killed probably 100 pounds of geese, 10 pounds of ducks, crows, one woodcock at least. And it's been deer hunting, actually. I mean, uh, on federal game lands where you can't use a uh, center fire rifle, it's got a slug barrel goes with it, and it's something nobody's ever heard of. It's the ES100 Pintail. I'm very proud of it. I know it's the redhead stepchild of the Beretta team, but I love it, and I'll always shoot it. And cut. Did I mention I like to shoot? Uh, got all these loaders, 410, 28. 20, 12, and the whole ass end of my Volvo is a shooting bag. So I've been known to shoot with a bunch of Remington guys with my Beretta at JB's house. I've been known to belch fire at geese with the uh, ES100, and then there was a, the infamous five minute turkey hunt. And I've definitely been known to powder some clays at the Rockingham County Gun Club in North Carolina. But the main thing, Takeaway point is that if you give me an A300, it'll go to a good home because I shoot more, more often.